One of the last big summer blockbusters hit theaters this past weekend, and it's another hit for Brad Pitt. Here's Live at Four's film critic Will Loper with this week's Loper Report. Hey, Susan and Mark. If you're a fan of action, you'll want to board the bullet train, which sped to number one at the box office this past weekend with 30 million. Talk to me. I am ready. You are getting the new and improved me. Because if you put peace out in the world, you get peace back. I think you might be forgetting what you do for a living. Brad Pitt stars as a reluctant assassin who just needs to get a briefcase off a train. Only problem is that train is filled with other assassins, including Lemon and Tangerine, played by Brian Tyree Henry and Aaron Taylor Johnson. We need to find a person who took that case. Of course, the story isn't quite that simple. There's Tarantino level jumping around in the plot as we see backstories and flashbacks play out, which can feel convoluted, but just stay strapped in because everything does tie together in the end. Get off at the next stop. Not so easy when you say it. The action is mostly fun, including one sequence where Pitt and Henry fight in the quiet car. <laughs> but the humor and dialogue feel like thrift store guy Richie, never quite nailing the tone it wants to. What's happening to your face? Maybe there was a little head trauma? Maybe. Still, if you need two hours to just turn your brain off and watch a bunch of over-the-top fight scenes and action sequences on high-speed rail, Bullet Train will more than satisfy you. Fans of action and Guy Ritchie humor, this is the movie for you. Over on streaming services, new on Netflix Wednesday is the second season of the addictive reality series, Indian Matchmaking. I'm back. In the past, matchmaking was easy. But it has become tough for me. And when they come to me, they have a lot of criteria. They want everything. The guy has a tattoo, that's a huge plus. If someone has enough hair to do a man bun, great. I'm ovo lacto semi vegetarian. I don't do a magical wish with a want. Newly streaming on Discovery Plus is the series Recipe Lost and Found. I need to know who your grandma was and what her history was, where she came from, what ingredients she might have used, and when. We're hoping to find this recipe, and we're hoping that you can help us with that. Chef Casey Korn helps people discover the long-lost recipes in their families. Dishes. They're convinced there were no breadcrumbs in the meatballs. Just because they didn't see them doesn't mean they're not there. Family recipes always have some little thing that makes them different. There are as many different recipes as there are grannies, and that's just the Absolutely. bottom line. And streaming on Wednesday on Disney Plus is the series I Am Groot. <laughs> I Am Groot. The Guardians of the Galaxy spinoff stars that cute little talking tree known as Groot in several vignettes. I'm Groot. <laughs> For Live at Four, I Am Groot. I, I mean, I Am Will Loper. I Am Groot.